a toddler tragedy. A boy beaten to death inside a home, and this morning his mother faced a judge. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us. I'm Justin Mormon. And I'm Bridget Ellison. We first brought you this disturbing story Friday when the mother and two others were arrested. Mark Lehman joins us now live in studio. And Mark, you just learned some new information about the mother's charges, right? Yes, Justin. Just within the last 30 minutes, a judge found probable cause to support a chi charge of a child neglect against the boy's mother, which means at least for now, she remains in jail. 23-year-old Brandy McCarzel is facing a charge of child neglect after the beating death of her son, three-year-old Xavier McCarzel Satchel, on Friday. Deputies say the toddler died at the hands of McCarzel's girlfriend, Lakeisha Lewis, and her girlfriend's mother, Colleen Barton. After waking up to the sound of Barton yelling at her son, McCarzel says she witnessed Lewis beat the child with a wand used for window blinds. The boy's mother then says she tried to grab her son but was confronted by Barton, who threw Xavier down a hallway. While investigators say McCarzel was not directly directly responsible for her son's death, they pointed to a history of known child abuse. Non-action is action. Under neglect, I agree. Non-action is action. Um, that's well stated. And during today's hearing, the judge set McCarzel's bond at $2,500, which means she could post bond as early as this afternoon. In the meantime, we're hearing from the boy's family today. We'll have more with them later on this afternoon on News 6, starting at 4. Bridget. Mark, thank you. 